Well, the WWE fans are freaking out now, right? Why? Jamie? Yeah, yeah. What's that about? They announced last night that the Saudi investment fund bought the WWE, I believe. Okay. Well, what are you going to do? What happens now? I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> I just, I no, what there, happens now? Well, there's no uh, divas. There's not going to be any women. That's Look at that. Vince headlines. McMahon. WWE talent done if company is sold to Saudi oh. Arabia. Thank CJ you, brother. Wrestling. It says it's not sold to Saudi Arabia, according to them. So this is what was happening on Twitter last night. Oh. Twitter, WWE Twitter world freaked out. It was like trending all night. Well, People go to Snopes. Oh, no. What does Snopes have to say? Oh, they had an answer? Oh, they yeah. Did. Is WWE being so uh, research, research in progress. progress? Oh, still going. So yes. So the answer is yes, and they just can't Jeez. leak it. Yes. <laughs> no, but well, I, uh, the money comes around if it's it's a substantial increase in money. I think here's the deal. I, I understand tradition, but if these guys want an alternative league to play in, who who uh, fucking let them go play? I don't. Who gives a shit? I don't know. Why do you need a monopoly of one league? I mean, you look at the history. That's of not what the problem is. What, what people have a problem with is Jamal Khashoggi. Jamal Khashoggi, who was a journalist for the Washington Post, who was dismembered at the Turkish embassy at the supposedly at the instructions of the Saudi royals. Yeah. He, he was criti critical of them. Yeah, but I mean, uh, I don't know, man. I don't know who, and I don't know who, who literally is funding. They could be just Saudi businessmen that are funding live. I don't know this particulars, but... I don't know. That's what I'm saying is like, uh, whatever. If they want to go play in that league and they're comfortable with it, let them go play, I guess. Fuck it. What an American perspective. Well, let them go play. It's fucking capitalism, baby. You want to get that, that fucking check, dude? That's the Trump perspective. Well, get that fucking check, dude. Trump told them it's an amazing, amazing organization. They're doing great things. Doing great things. Go get that money. I think, honestly, here's the good, what's really going to happen. They're going to go get that money and then they're going to leave. <laughs> then it's going to be over and it's going to dissipate into nothing. Or not. If they have that kind of cheddar... They have enough cheddar, they could literally keep this going forever if they no, wanted yeah, to. Yeah, yeah. And they it's, wouldn't put a dent in them. No, no, it's not that. And you're right. It's more that what guys are going to be willing to either stay there or continue to go over there. So the problem is the talent, right? It's like anything else. It's like, But they're having the events here. Correct. I went to one. So you don't have to stay. You don't have to go over there. I don't. I don't think they only. I, only th I think they only play one over there. All, all of them are here. Like I mm. went to one in Chicago, Rich Harvest Farms. Uh, and yeah, I mean, I, you know, look, it's it's really interesting to to see the internal uproar, which I immediately attribute to golf is an old tradition sport, so people are really particular, so they don't even like that someone's entering the conversation. The outs, the other perspective, obviously, is the one that is the bigger deal is people are people are think it's an immoral move, right? An unethical so move. If unethical it was move. instead some enormous hedge fund got together and they put all their money together and decided to fund their own alternative golf. Agency, People, or they'd be golf fucked tour. just as mad. I right. think they would be just as upset. People would be, the PGA does not want competition. They don't like that guys are even thinking about going. And then I think personally, they're shoehorning in the Saudi stuff to go, and that's bad. See, they're more mad about business interests. They don't give a. F they don't fucking care about how the Saudi much of shit. a f effect is it having on the top players? Nothing. I mean, my buddy, my buddy's doing a documentary that's coming out on Netflix. Uh, I think coming up soon in the first quarter of the year about. Um, the PGA and during it during the middle of the filming half of the guys left and went to live and he films both perspectives So and it's supposed to be really good It's just It's not changed much 